In this example, we're asked to divide two polynomials. To do so, we're going to have to use long division. And why I know that is because of this uh, denominator being a second degree polynomial. So to accomplish this, let's go ahead and set it up. Okay, we're going to divide 10x squared plus 13x plus 18, that's our dividend, divided by 2x squared plus 3x plus 3. And this is going to work out to be a pretty easy example. All right, what we want to do is we want to, we've set it up so that um, everything is in descending order. We didn't skip any powers of x, so we don't really need any placeholders of like 0x to the first powers. So we want to focus right here on this 2x squared and the very first term on the inside there, the 10x squared. So to get started, you say to yourself, 2x squared multiplied by what makes exactly 10x squared? I think in this case, it's going to be 5. Next, we're going to take that 5 and it's going to get distributed and multiplied by each one of these terms out here in the divisor. So as we distribute, we say 5 times 2x squared makes 10x squared. And then 5 times 3x makes 15x. And then 5 times positive 3 makes positive 15. All right, with long division, we next subtract down. Now we've planned it out that the first terms are going to cancel out. They're going to be the exact same. But the rest of these you want to be a little bit careful of. That negative, that subtraction, gets distributed. So it really is 13x minus 15x. Sometimes writing this horizontally helps out. So 13x's minus 15x's, combining those like terms, leaves us with negative 2x's. And similarly, we have 18 minus 15. That negative gets distributed again, so we're going to get positive 3 down here. Now, because our divisor has an x squared, and what we're left with down to, at the bottom only has x to the first power, that means we're done. All right, next, let's go ahead and identify the 5. We call that our quotient. And that's going to correspond to the q of r. And then the negative 2x plus 3, we're going to call that the remainder. That's going to correspond to the r of x. So we can always rewrite our long division there as the quotient plus the remainder, negative 2x plus 3, over the divisor, the 2x squared plus 3x plus 3. And, um, you know, kind of the first box goes, the q is going to be 5, and the second box, the r of x, is going to be negative 2x plus 3. So I hope this helps out. Good luck as you're working on dividing polynomial functions.